Hi everyone, it's Curse of Minecraft YouTube channel. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Today, I'm only talking about our lineup. So this is the final 22. Plus my cool stuff, I will go through as well. On top of that, and if you're returning my post, welcome. If you're new to the channel, watching this for the first time, like, comment, and subscribe. Um, Collingwood, as me all know, play Melbourne at the SCG. Now this reminds me of a game that 20 years ago when Chris Tarrant took mark of the year at the MCG. We would have been 10 years old at the time. Um, but now, you know, 20 years since, it, it's remarkable. So I'll go as for those who are watching this for the first time, what I'll do is I, I have, I'll let you guys have your opinions on it and what you think of the, of the lineups, who you think that would be in medical stuff, but I will go through the defense, midfield, forward line, and I'll go through the, you know, the ones in man on who I think that would go in as a medical sub as well. Um, so Rufford, Noble and, and Maynard. Now that's a pretty good back three. Um, I'll go through the other backs, the, the rest of the back three. It feels like to me that we're playing a team that I feel that we can really control Melbourne's forward line. I think Maynard will go on to pick it. I think that's much of that has to happen. Um, as much as anything. And if we don't see that, who knows what's on oh, who will. Um, I think with Maynard, he, he's a special player. He doesn't get outmarked that often. You know, does his job and plays his heart out week in, week out as well so there's certainly a good back back three as well Rafford he's gonna have a a job on either Tom McDonald you'll think on that um I don't think Ben Brown's playing this game but they do have you know, a couple of different players in that four line as well as much as anything and John Noble I say he's one of the, he's come to age he really has playing that defensive fifteen expression especially in the back pocket he, he's really shown the reason why that he has played really good footy. Um Darcy Moore Maine and I think we got Crane up. Now Darcy Moore is the best inset defender in the competition right now. He's come out and really performed. You know, the one thing I will say with Darcy is to play forward and pull back in defence for that month of footy work, it didn't work. All right, keep the couple of girls against West Coast. That's what we're known for, you know. They can kick some guys, he's, he's kicked far before. Um, we had him in defence because we feel like we feel like he can be that player that can take Mark and run off. And I think by showing off his pace, showing off he, you know his ability to wanting to take the game on, I think it's really good as well, as much as anything. Chris Main, what a player that he's become. Um, Came to Collingwood at the end of 2016. 2017 didn't have a good year at all. Struggled to find his way. Um, played really well in the, on the wing and playing across half back. So you're always going to get something with that as much as anything. Starting to show a really good footy. Um, as well as Isaac Crane, like he came in the mid season draft. Really good player. He's a player for me, I reckon, that can take the game on. Um, as much as anything. So, 
we still got a bit to learn. It's still something to improve with him to, you know, not put him on the place like a Toby Green type, have Maynard on him. Other than that, I really feel like that's the way that you're gonna that you gotta play your footy, but I feel like now we're gonna have to have a lot of fun in, in having faith in him to play his role, and I know that he will. Um, Polter, Sabon, Hoskin, Elliot. Lynch, Penderbury, and Jack Cripps. Um, I'll, I'll start with the Rockman. He has, Lynch has to play well. There, there's no use in butts in this game. You fucking play well. Needs, he needs to play his role and, and compete with Max Gorn because Max Gorn will bath him. Right, uh, and, and us midfielders, we have to help out. We really do. Um, you know, Penderbury, about fucking time. Put him in the midfield. Um, it's, it's good to have some plays in there that, that you can probably develop. But Penderbury, for mine, is a midfielder. Um, Jack Cripps, he's a hard back line card, but he's doing a really good job in the midfield. Simple as that. Um, willing to take that on and show the reason why he's that good of a player. Mr. Consistent hasn't missed any games at Collingwood at all. Um, he's a number one pick for every game. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Um, Polter, he's come on nicely, in my opinion. Um, playing on the wing, generally generally a, a, a tenure player, I think. And I think with him, he'll play his role, he'll do everything he can. And I think it's good to develop him, see what he can do as well on top of that. Um, Sir Bonham is a star, you know. He's getting a bit old with age. I, I don't feel it has to slow down a little bit. It's not it's not as bad, but I think with that as well, you got to see the, the good and the bad with him. I play him personally. I think he gives you that grunt as much as anything. And Will Hoskin Elliott, he's been in great form. Continues to improve. Why not? It, it's a bit of an in your face when it comes to that. It's, as much as anything, um, with the midfielders. Now the forward line, it's interesting. Bianca, Cameron, Murphy, Degoe, Mycheck, and Elliot. Now Jamie Elliot just got a fire up this week. Um, he's a man that can really spark that forward line as much as anything. Degoe. He has to lift. Simple as that. No ifs and buts about it. Must lift. Um, if, we, if we're going to win, we're going to have to win real well. My check needs to stand up and perform. Um, look, he, he, he'll be on May, you would think, with that match up. Um, as much as anything, you're going to have to really play good. And in, in this Melbourne lineup, you know how good their defence is. Um, Cameron, he's going to have to step up. Now, I thought we would play Mason Cox in this game because he's had a habit of, of kicking goals against Melbourne um, as much as anything. So, I think with the way that we're playing, you know, we have gone for the speed. But I think in the, at the end of the day, I think it will be great. I think as well on top of that. Bianca. 
Now with Bianca, he's performed really well. Performed really well. He has shown why he's that good, Bianca. He's played really well. Um, and Murphy as well. Like, he, he continues to impress me. Now, this is his lineup. Now, the interchange. Now, before I do that, there is a couple changes. So, obviously, Main and McCreary are in. Um, Brown, Wilson, and Rental are out. But the interchange is Dacos, Thomas, McCreary, and Madden. I think Madden will have to go in, in defence or between defence or playing up forward as well. Um, he's not a forward, but defender he is. Dacos, I think he will come on and either play in the midfield or he might go up forward. Either way, he's, he's shown why he can, you know, kick kick a goal. He loves the goal. And he, he definitely knows where they are. Um, Thomas, hopefully, he can lift up again and just continue to impress. Um, it's, it's a must from him. And McCreary... Haven't seen him in a while. Um, plays, plays in his heart on his level. Like he, he, he did really well on, on Anzac Day. And shows the reason why he's that good. So I do think that with that we can continue to improve and, and he can continue to develop. And I think he will. Now, with the. We've got Callum Brown, Cox, Rantel, and Wilson. I think it will be Brown. I, I think Ca Callum Brown will be the medical sub. So, and, and the reason why I think that he's done, he's done it last week, I think he'll do it this week. I think he's a top player that can impact on the game of footy can come on whenever we need to but it's just my opinion if I have to go for the second one we might go with a, either a Cox or or Rentel that's the end of my video of my lineups like comment subscribe I still think we can win um I, I will go through to see how much a pick Collingwood buy, but I still think we'll win and I think we'll be a close game. Till next time, go to the pies and I'll do my mid-season video for the teams that have got the buy.